Good afternoon everybody, it's Sheila from Boho Daydreams. Thank you for joining me again for another preview of a textile bundle. This one is 60 plus pieces again and it's wrapped in a piece of um, sari and tied with a piece of sari, a piece of silk sari um, wrap. Um, I'm just going to go quickly through this. A lot of the pieces are going to be familiar to you, but there's a lot of new pieces. So we'll just go through what's on top. This is how it comes to you, um, wrapped up with the silk and then tied with the with the ribbon. So I'm just going to show these to you quickly. I hope you can see that. I hope the light's reflecting okay on that. And these come from um, dresses and tunics. So they're very limited because the bodices are decorated with these, but there's not very many on the bodices. And a piece of trim, another piece of trim. This piece of uh, trim from a dupata. You can see all the sparkles on them. The back you can see all the little threads are all hand beaded. This is a piece from the the sari snippet roll that I found um, that's just done up in little bits and pieces. So these are all different. Every kit has one of these. Just a piece of purple lilac. There isn't a lot of this so everybody got a little piece of this. I used this piece again. It was in my last bundle. Oh, so pretty. And this comes from one of the wedding lahenias that I have. I have like two, I have three, three of them. This is one of them. It's a beautifully beaded uh, sorry, scarf, hand beaded. And I found some yellow, so I decided to add that. It's not very common. It's a beautiful piece of a dipata. Very sheer. Little sequins all over. A little beading. Now this is a beautiful piece and it's in half of, oops, I don't know if you can see that. It's in half of the kits. Um, the other half of the kits are going to have a heavier beaded piece from um, my other wedding, um, my wedding lahenia that I've cut up, and I'm just going to show it to you. This here is lighter, so for the or for the um, international, it's easier. It's lighter weight, so I ship these instead. But you'll see something a little more along this style in your in the in the USA packages. And there might be just a snippet piece in the overseas packages. It's just so heavy that um, the shipping is just astronomical. And I fight those spider threads all the time. Beautiful piece. This is almost gone, so the pieces are now just a little bit smaller, so everybody gets a piece. This is beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Comes from a tunic, beautiful silk tunic. See, all those threads. Here's another piece from the wedding lahenia. It's from the scarf. This is a piece of lace. It's beautiful. 
and each piece can be cut into a nice little square. So you've got four pieces there. And every kit has one of these. Another beautiful, I don't know if you can see the sparkle on that. And the fabrics. Beautiful fabrics. The sheen, the way they weave their fabrics is just beautiful. And this is an interesting piece. It's rather textured with some sequins, but it's iridescent and it's kind of a celery to uh, taupey type of color and it's variegated. We've all seen this one before. Beautiful piece of, of lilac silk. And all this threading in here, those are metal threads. I didn't know that until I got one caught in my scissors. And a piece of my pashmina. Just an interesting piece of, of fabric. And this is the match to the one you just saw. I like to match them. That way you've got coordinating pieces for each page. There are a few kits that have the peach color because um, the other ones have the light pieces with the red beading on it, but I ran out of that. It's all gone, so this is substituted. Another piece of very interesting fabric from a dupata. Just a little, little embellishment. And if you see this, it's because I didn't cut it off. Maybe you have a use for it, so I just leave that as is. Some of these are so beautiful, like on both sides. Beautiful pink with gold. This is beautiful. It's gold with rose gold. And it is beautiful on both sides. And this is just kind of a compliment. I love this. I love this one. It's, it's variegated, so you can see it's lighter here and then it goes dark again. I just love this. I'll be sad when that one's all gone. Some sequins and embroidery. Just a piece of silk. And this is an interesting piece because this piece goes from aqua to coral to orange and then to pink. So if you got a pink piece like this, your piece is larger and you'll have an extra three little sequined um, flowers. And I've used this one before. It's so pretty. It's got little mirrors in it. This one is a purple with gold with a lighter pink with purple, almost. It's so pretty. And this is a kind of a burnt red. Very pretty. So, so pretty. Sometimes the uh, camera just can't pick up the beauty in the pieces that I see. And when you get your kit, then you can, you can see the difference. This is beautiful. This is a very beautiful piece. You can see the way it's woven. Gorgeous. Beautiful dark burgundy lace. Now the laces, I don't know. They're likely not authentic, but they're so beautiful that I've included some lace pieces. This is kind of a match to the lace. 
And this is, I believe, gone now, so I don't believe any future kits will have that. This is a kind of a staple, boho staple, this piece of silk. And this is very pretty. It's kind of variegated from the aqua, turquoise, aqua-ish to a coral. And this is new. So pretty. Um, you'll see this in future kits too. And possibly even um, for journal covers. I have a lot of this. My piece is pretty big. I just cut this. It's beautiful yellow and white embroidery on a, a thicker piece of cotton. Beautiful, beautiful. This is iridescent. The flower is iridescent. So they've woven a lot of different colors into this fabric to make it so iridescent. Whoops, that's upside down. It's kind of a turquoise, tealish, very textured, very interesting piece. Love it. And this is now about gone too. So this is the outer edge, so it's much more decorated than you've seen before in this piece. Piece of silk. Another beautiful piece of silk. And it's the match to this, simply because some of them will be wrapped in this, but I hate for you to have to cut this to use it as a pocket, so I always include a piece of, piece of, or try to always include a piece of the wrap. Another beautiful piece of silk, very, very shiny piece of silk. Very sparkly, sequined, beautiful. This is another lovely textured piece, very interesting piece of fabric. Beautiful. And kind of a variegated blue lace. And this piece here, I thought, oh look, it's beautiful flocked um, with flowers until I started cutting it. So anybody that feels that they um, don't want this piece can tell me or just throw it away. It's a, um, it looks like it's uh, sugar skulls. And I didn't see that when I found that in the, uh, in the uh, exotic section or um, my global section. But it is kind of interesting, but it might not be to everybody's taste. So I thought I would include that for people who actually um, can use that. But if you're, you don't like that, just throw it away. And then there's another piece of textured, very textured black lace. It's very beautiful, very textury. Also included will be a variety of um, sari strips. I have all colors. I've made a whole bunch of them, so I'll include those. And as always, well, not always, but when I get to making um, a YouTube video, I always like to include something special in one box. So somebody will um, find this in their box and it comes from um, one of the tunics. They always, they're very decorated. So I'm gonna put this into, it's very sparkly. I'm gonna put this into somebody's box so somebody will um, receive this. Um, let me see what else do I have to say. Um, I am going away on September 4th and I should be back on the 7th and I'm just finishing up some custom orders still. Hopefully I'll get those done all done before I leave but if I don't I'll be working on that and it is possible since I didn't make that journal since I realized I needed more than just paper and um, the embossing machine. Um, I didn't I didn't make the journal so I will be 
packing that all up to take with me uh, and last week in September to last week in October I'll be gone so there'll be nothing sent out at that time so if you have a custom that you you are interested in just let me know I'll be working on those when I come back and I hope everyone's having a wonderful weekend I want to thank everybody so much for supporting me in this um, it's been it's been a tremendous experience I just want to thank you all have a good weekend bye